I am Miss Anna Brown. I'm sorry if I startled you. Mr. Ellsworth. Uh, Lefty Ellsworth. Mr. Ellsworth. No, I, you know, it was quite an experience for me, really. I, uh, will you do it again? Uh, if I get invited, I will. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you know, yeah. yeah. But I like, it wasn't too much for you? Uh, yes, but uh, I'd do it again anyway. All right, good. <laughs> you even told me you were going to be the replacement for Bill Gates. No. I think you had a few too many Cosmos that night. I told you I got billed for replacement gates at my apartment complex. Damn it. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> nah, man. I think we did really good. I think it was a, I think it was a lot harder than it was last year, man. But um, why? Why was it harder? It was harder because the competition was a lot better this year. Um, I expected, I expected good competition, but I didn't expect it to be that good, man. But, <laughs> I think we still held our own in there, man. So I'm pretty satisfied with, with the way we looked. So, All right, good. Yeah, still nervous, man. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I had a great time. It was wonderful seeing all the wonderful films by everybody. A uh, great group of talent in this region of the Kentucky area. So you're going to do it next year? I think so. This is my third year and it's been a blast every time. Are you I had a great just acting time. in or are you doing any production? Or well, um, acting this year I actually did a little bit of background music for the director's cut of our movie. So. Ah, so you're giving away some of your secrets. Yeah, 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 yeah. I guess we have to look this guy up. <laughs> So I guess that was a lot of fun then. Now, now what was your character in that? Um, Lucy Ellsworth. Lucy Ellsworth. That's obviously, I think there's a lot of Lucy Ellsworth in this today. Now, what, what, was, what was your job? Like, what did you do? What was your character's main um, goal? I was the daughter of an inventor who invents time travel, and I had to go back in time and stop him because it kind of destroys the world. So time travel destroys the world, so you were going to go back and stop him from inventing time Wow, that's a little messed up. Yeah. Little... Gentlemen, welcome to the 5031st Biannual Intergalactic Brain Games. Brought to you, of course, by Zignar's Head Powder. That second head isn't a problem anymore. <laughs> I'm Jim Moonrock, and with me as always is Bob Pulsating Quasar. What's up with the mask, Bob? <laughs> you know my species needs this gas to live, you racist ass. <laughs> 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 so what'd you think? What'd you think of the premiere? You like it? Loved it, loved it. Sean, Katie, she can whoop my ass any day of the week. She can fight. We stayed up all night. We was grumpy. We had a little season pizza, though. We had pizza. We, did, we, we did had pizza. We had pizza. I just like being down with VLTV. Jason, too funny. <laughs> he rhymes everything. It's awesome. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> What are you into these days? Uh, I keep myself busy. I, I, I'm obviously staying in shape. Uh, I'm doing improv at the comic club club down the street. Yeah, What'd you think, Dale? It was fantastic. We go 48 hours, no sleep. <laughs> then, then to watch everybody laugh, have a good time. It was, it was great. You know, as long as you're doing it with people that you uh, appreciate. And have fun doing it. Yeah, it's, it's fantastic. So I don't know about to do it again next year or not, but you gotta do these things like every other year. <laughs> but they were fantastic. She is the next action star right here. Look out for her. <laughs> what the hell? What about me? <laughs> I was the one kicking ass. You're the gun expert. You see, Sean? Kicking ass and kicking ass. Wait, no, that's She got shot. Ah. Yo, how did you let this happen? That was out of no. The security is more than we anticipated. I put the box. Pressure on the wound. Spirit destiny. What is an echo of spirit? Maybe the same time frame, or can you guys pick, like, you know, a spring or fall time when it's not so damn hot? <laughs> I don't know, you tell that's, me. That's part of the challenge. <laughs> no, I really like. Um, I have kind of staked my claim on the weekend between Forecastle and Fandom Fest. Um, 
it just you have uh, Lebowski Fest that happens in there, and then 48. Um, so you hey, fandom 48 forecastle. It's all F's. Oh, it's F's. like F July. Um, F and H now. <laughs> uh, but I just like that kids are out of school. You know, if, if they want to participate, it, it's more doable for them. That said, um, there are opportunities for uh, us to do off-season events, and I did a little poll to try to gauge interest in that, um, doing either something like a horror fest around Halloween or a romantic fest around Valentine's Day. I mean, there are other opportunities. All right, guys, we have watched the films, and let me tell you, this city is so full of talent, it is ridiculous. There are so many good films. I don't know how the panel is going to choose, but there are three judges, and they will judge on all the things that you can think of, the sound, special effects, um, makeup, acting, cinematography, the whole 15, 20 yards, however many different categories there is. But it was absolutely incredible. We want to say a big thank you to Chad, who's the one who put it on. Thank you very much for having us out here and for doing this whole 48-hour film fest. Um, again, the talent here is ridiculous, so I hope you enjoyed all of it, and we will let you know who won. But until then, you just have to wait. <laughs>